Hello, in today's tutorial I present a speed detector. An easy project but with multiple uses. By positioning the two sensors on the hole of a tube, the speed of movement of even a bullet can be detected. For this project you need the following components, one Arduino board, two infrared modules, an OLED display and an active buzzer. The project code is built with the help of the Visuino program, an easy and intuitive software with the help of which you can build projects with microcontrollers very easily, with just mouse clicks. Find the download link in the description. Also in the description you can find the code in multiple formats Arduino IDE, Visuino and Electrical Diagram. Also links to other interesting projects with Arduino and Visuino. Let's do a little detailing of the code. We open the Visuino program and load the code. The operating principle is very simple. When the first sensor detects an obstacle, it activates the timer 1 component that keeps the clock generator on until the moment when sensor 2 detects an obstacle. The clock generator drives a counter. At the moment of detection at sensor 2, an instantaneous capture of the analog value is made. This value is divided by 100 to read the value in seconds. Furthermore, this value divides the distance value to fulfill the physical formula, speed equals distance per time. The value is expressed in meters, in the present case 15 centimeters, 0.15 meters. The analog value component represents the distance between the sensors The obtained value is multiplied by 36 to convert into kilometers per hour. Further, there are converters for display and comparators for sound. At a value over 100 km per hour the sound will be longer, at a lower value the sound will be shorter. The three delay components reset the timers and erase the display after a time of about 3 seconds from the triggering of sensor 2, putting the device in the position of waiting for a new reading. Upload the code to the Arduino. Connect the device to the voltage source and wait a few seconds. At this moment the device is in the standby position. If you liked my project, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.